7 Eyewitness News has an eye on education and the safety of students as they head back to class. This year, Erie County's district attorney is speaking directly to classrooms about school threats, the dangers of them, and why they're nothing to joke about. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Hannah Bueller gives us a closer look at the DA's new initiative. After the uh, incident that occurred last year in Florida, we here in Western New York saw a rash of individuals, mainly students, posting threats on social media. So Erie County District Attorney John Flynn wasted no time getting right in front of the students. This first day of school in West Seneca, Assistant District Attorney spoke about the consequences of making threats against other students and schools. Dangers of uh, using social media as a threatening tool. Uh, the, the, the dangers of getting involved with people who are talking about school threats. Following the Parkland shooting, D.A. Flynn created the School Critical Incident Initiative. He assigned each of his staff members to a Western New York school and will work with the district on things like identifying a threat, how to preserve evidence in the event of an emergency, and how to establish a protocol. It's important that we as educators work with the resources we have. We have a great partnership with the West Seneca Police Department and now we're able to uh, add another tool to our tool belt with the partnership with the district attorney's office. West Seneca East High School principal Jason Winnicki says threats are a reality. In the last year, West Seneca saw between four and five threats. Flynn says after Parkland, there are about 20 threats to schools across western New York. Flynn says when kids know the severity, it could help nip it in the bud. You're facing felony charges potentially, uh, depending on the nature of the threat, uh, depending on the medium that you use. You're, you're facing potentially a felony charge here, so up to seven years in jail for a D felony. So the, the consequences are severe. Gave them the same message of these are some of the things that could happen if you make a poor choice, but, you know, stick to your hopes and dreams. And West Seneca also has a partnership with the West Seneca Police Department and a full-time school resource officer. Principal Winnicki says the response from students has been overwhelmingly positive with this initiative, learning these very important consequences well before it's too late. We're live in the newsroom tonight. Hannah Bueller, 7 Eyewitness News. Okay.